everybody, it's Lance, and I'm going to make another broth tail for you. This time we're going to be using our Thai lemongrass to make a lemongrass ginger hot brothy. And this is a fantastic mid-morning kind of drink because it really gives you a nice satisfaction. Sometimes I get hungry between breakfast and lunch, and I just want something to hold me over. It's kind of light. It's really easy. But we're just going to use a couple of very simple ingredients. We're going to first here, we're going to use some ginger and we're going to use some lemon. And again, uh, one of the Thai lemongrass broth bags. And open this up right now. Take out one of the broth bags. Uh, one of the major uh, uh, benefits of, of using this is it's really simple. You just use eight ounces of hot water. Make sure you only use eight ounces. This is a temperature sensitive cup. so. Uh, it can be it can take hot water don't just use any kind of glass cup but we've got i already know that uh, the measure for this at that point is eight ounces and that's going to give me the best taste without diluting the flavor of the broth bag so what i've done is i've um, removed the skin a little bit from the ginger root right there and we're gonna prepare some of the ingredients while it's steeping. You wanna give the broth bag four minutes to steep, and that's uh, ample enough time to, to get this all ready. So we're just gonna make a couple of cuts here. We're not gonna cut the, lem the uh, ginger into too small of pieces because we don't wanna overwhelm the broth. And what happens is as you put this in, the ginger actually cooks and releases the flavor. So, uh, and you'll find out that you get most of the flavor towards the end of drinking the, the broth. So we've got that going. I'm gonna take my lemon here and just cut a slice. And we're gonna do two things with it. First off, we're going to uh, give the, the rim a nice taste of the lemon too because when you taste when you get a first taste of the lemon it's kind of nice and then we're just going to squeeze a little bit of the lemon in and then we have a nice little garnish there to make it look fancy so i think we're a couple minutes in to the steeping i'm going to use a basil and garlic dazzler also i love garlic so i'm just going to give it a little extra kick of garlic there i'm going to mix that all around and Make sure, as you can see, the, the color is changing now. What you want to make sure of is that you really give the broth bag a good squeeze. The Most of the flavor kind of gets trapped in there unless you do that. And sometimes people will say that the, the broth is too watery. Well, if you use too much water, it will be like that. And if you don't squeeze the bag enough to get the flavor out, then yeah, it will, it will be kind of a, a weak flavor. But this is going to be perfect. As you can see, the more I the more I squeeze that out, the the more the color changes. So it looks like it's pretty much ready right now. And again, I'm going to leave the broth bag in while I drink it because uh, I get I'm going to get a super uh, savory uh, end to my to my drink. And here we go. Mm, very nice, full flavor, savory. Got a hint of the ginger, so the ginger is going to take a little while for it to really bloom and blossom in the in the drink. But that lemon kind of gives it a nice little perk up, and uh, so there you go. Until next time, looking forward to seeing you. Thank you.